approached a mask is sent suddenly a light from now heaven shone he around him and falling to the ground he, he heard a voice saying to him suddenly a light from heaven shone around him and falling to the ground and he said Welcome. That was a canon called Who Are You, Lord? And it's written for the conversion of Paul. This passage is taken from Acts chapter 9, verses 3 through 5. I'm here with my friends Georgia and Emily, and we're going to teach it to you. So we'll start by breaking up each of the four phrases. I'll warn you, this one isn't incredibly difficult, but it is fairly lengthy. So we're going to do four phrases, and each of them will break up into halves. So repeat after me, Georgia and Emily will be singing with you. First phrase, first half, sounds like this. Now as he went on his way. Now as he went on his way. He approached Damascus and suddenly a light. He approached Damascus and suddenly a light. Okay, put those two together. Sounds like this. Now as he went on his way, he approached Damascus and suddenly a light. Now as he went on his way, he approached Damascus and suddenly a light. Okay, second phrase, first half, sounds like this. From heaven shone around him and falling to the ground. From heaven shone around him and falling to the ground. He heard a voice saying to him, Saul, Saul. He heard a voice saying to him, Saul, Saul. Okay. Going back, putting the whole second phrase together, sounds like this. From heaven shone around him and falling to the ground, he heard a voice saying to him, Saul, Saul. From heaven shone around him and falling to the ground, he heard a voice saying to him, Saul, Saul. Okay, halfway done. Before we move on, let's do phrases one and two together, all together. Ready? Now as he went on his way, he approached Damascus and suddenly a light from heaven shone around him and falling to the ground, he heard a voice saying to him, Saul, Saul. Okay, third phrase. Why are you persecuting me? Why are you persecuting me? And he said, Who are you, Lord? And he said, Who are you, Lord? Okay, now this is a really active one. 
Sometimes the hardest part is not the really active trilly notes, but the long waiting and locating a specific note coming out of nothing. So we were all struggling a little bit to get this next note, which is and he. So coming out of who are you, Lord, you count one, two, three, and then go and he said, I am Jesus whom you and he said, I am Jesus whom you. Okay, then there's a lot to this last half, so listen carefully. Are persecuting, but rise and enter the city. Are persecuting, but rise and enter the city. Okay, that's a tricky one to figure out how to break up. So if you're figuring, if you're having a hard time figuring out the rhythmic placement of any of those, it may actually be easier to just do the whole fourth phrase. So we'll try that. Um, starting at, but, no, and, he. Ready? And he said, I am Jesus whom you are persecuting, but rise and enter the city. And he said, I am Jesus whom you are persecuting, but rise and enter the city. Okay, so there's a lot to that fourth phrase. Feel free to repeat that as many times as you want to. Before we do the whole thing in unison, I think let's just isolate phrases three and four now. So starting on, why are you persecuting me? Ready? Why are you persecuting me? And he said, who are you, Lord? And he said, I am Jesus whom you are persecuting but rise and enter the city okay well do your best we're going to sing two times through in unison and then we'll put it back into canon after that so from the beginning ready now as he went on his way he approached damascus and suddenly a light from heaven shone around him and falling to the ground he heard a voice saying to him saul saul why are you persecuting me and he said who are you lord and he said i am jesus whom you are persecuting but rise and enter the city now as he went on his way he approached damascus and suddenly a light from heaven shone around him and falling to the ground he heard a voice saying to him saul saul why are you persecuting me? And he said, Who are you, Lord? And he said, I am Jesus whom you are persecuting, but rise and enter the city. Okay, well, hopefully that's close to learned, or you can just go ahead and repeat that portion as many times as you need to. We're going to go two more times through now in a three-part canon. So Emily will start, I will sing second, Georgia will sing third. You could all sing with Emily, or if you're in a group singing, you could split up into two or three or even four parts. Although I will say there's something about a four-part canon, especially one this active. It technically, it works on paper, but it, it you do tend to obscure the text. And even if you were not singing a bunch of different words, the, the voice leading gets a little muddy. So I kind of prefer this one in three parts only, um, but you could always try it. So we'll go two, two times like that, as soon as Emily's ready. Now as he went on his way, he approached Damascus and suddenly a light from heaven now shone he around him and falling way, to the ground. He, he heard a voice Damascus saying to him, and suddenly a light from heaven shone around him and falling to the and he said, Who are you, Lord? Suddenly a light, and I am shut around him and 
means as loud and he said I've heard a secuting black boys and enter the city That's the whole thing. I hope you had some success and I hope you had some fun and I hope it got you singing with your family God's word. Thanks for joining us.